Needing positivity all around you Many life struggles trying to hold you down When your goal is being great to push through dark clouds That try to tear you down Libra, oh Libra What's poppin' gangity gang 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 Did you miss me? Cause I missed your motherfucking ass. Listen. Hey, boo, hey, if this is your first time to my channel, I'm Mocha. Also, if this is your first time to my channel, look out, y'all. I cuss, all right? May cuss a little, may cuss a lot. Just depending on what the hell this energy, what the fuck this lick read within this energy, what the hell these cards say, etc., etc. Okay? For those of you who have liked, shared, subscribed, uh, recommend, refer people to uh, get readings. For those of you who do not donate, uh, donate it to the channel. For those of you who have sent me damn emails, just really, really, really shared your love with me you guys i appreciate it from the most humblest space ever okay thank you for the likes the shares the subscribes the comments the love all of that thank you all right um you guys this message ain't gonna resonate with every damn libra you guys take what does leave the rest if the damn shoe don't if that motherfucker shoe too big yeah it's gonna fall don't try and put on no damn shoe that don't fit you period okay this message will resonate for libra sun moon rising venus as well as the cross watchers and the north node or wherever it is that you have libra in your chart and this shit resonates okay or if it doesn't it's not your shit all right so without further ado libra let's go ahead and get into it also yeah we just gonna get into it. I already gave the PSA that I cuss. If you don't like cussing, there's me. There's a, a lot of fucking many, 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 many other fucking tarot readers on YouTube that that can further assist you without cussing. This is my shit. All right, and this is how we do it. Sha la 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 la. My shit. Okay. So I'm gonna be in the comment section saying, "Oh, you shouldn't curse because they're, they're, listen." Okay. Your guys, your guys got you. They way. My guys got me my way. They cuss. You did. So let's get into it. Libra, listen. <sighs> this reading is timeless. Okay? Whenever you're seeing this, you're being guided here at this time or at the time in which you need it. All right? Libras. Also, I apologize for not doing y'all reading for y'all birthday because Libras, it had been brought to my goddamn attention that, okay, and this could be uh, actually intuitive messages for uh, intuitive message for some of you all. Somebody that you put onto my channel, Libra, you and this person that could have like recently fallen out. You and this person could also be or there's like some weird ass energy between them. Someone was using other readers, but specifically my readers. If you are a Libra who have put someone else onto my readings, okay, or this is the time like and, and you got in the midst of you guys uh, sharing time, spending time with one another. You guys were watching my readings, okay. This person was using my readings in order to know how to counter react some type of a, a attack or somehow or try to manipulate a way to get some type of response out of you because they're they're fucking weird. Okay, that's that's why Libra. They're fucking weird. But whoever this individual is, they're they're a coward at heart. Okay, for some of you all, I'm literally hearing this could be the parent of your children. Okay, so this could be your child's mother, your child's father. For some of you all, I'm also hearing something about a childhood friend as well. All right, but someone was trying to get some type of hidden information or something that you stop sharing with them because some of you all have realized that this motherfucker is weird the energy is weird and you kind of cut the access to this person's uh, motherfucking information bank on the ass all right in your life and i feel like this person was trying to use my information my readings in order to know how to manipulate you into spending time or stopping some type of plan that you have for your motherfucking birthday somebody was trying to manipulate a way to be a fucking distraction and fucking weird okay so i apologize but y'all had a few motherfucking haters with they fucking microscopic ass glasses on and a lot of you all are working on some really big shit and it just i felt as your fucking family okay i tried to do your reading a few times i have never had that much fucking resistance and that's happened to me like the last couple of times that i've done libra reading so for some of you all you're cutting the damn cords you're you're cutting energetic cords as it pertains to dealing with other people some of you all this have to do with some type of environmental space okay this could literally be a move or a need to move some of you all are getting a lot of um clear cognizant or clairvoyant downloads or some of you all I'm hearing clear cognizance clairvoyance some of you all are realizing those gifts or you're trying to master those gifts at this time okay I'm also hearing mediumship if you are a medium all right some of you all have some paranormal shit in your damn house and they're saying that you need spirit is saying that you need to discern what spirits that you've been entertaining because for some of you all you've been dealing with trickster spirits okay I pick up on this energy of someone trying to like siphon siphon uh, siphon your energy or siphon your knowledge through some type of like subconscious bank or, or someone kind of like infiltrating your dream space within the astral okay 
Listen, I don't know if you got fire sign in your motherfucking chart, but I remember specifically a fire sign reading when I said, listen, I'm very in tune with my motherfucking shadows and my light. So, Libra, some of y'all may have to choke a hoe. You get what I'm saying? Choke that hoe. How did you get here? Bitch, I choked you out. <laughs> Nobody's supposed to be here. Okay? Fuck you talking about? Bitch, what you up in here for? I'm choking you the fuck out. All right? That's a real fucking thing with people dying and they got them. But what are you here for? Okay? Someone's trying to infiltrate your dream space. This could literally be someone who does the same thing you do or work in the same field as you. Okay? I'm hearing that some of you all are tarot readers. All right? Some of you all are spiritual teachers. Some of you all are mentors. Some of you all, you have a life purpose around working with the youth. Okay? I'm also hearing fashion designers. Fashion. All right? But really connecting with that element of self. Because for some of you all, some of y'all could have recently just cut everybody off. Some of y'all could also be going on some type of like social media fast. Someone was like watching you or obsessed with you or watching your motherfucking social media for some of y'all this is the ex of your ex on some shit this bitch still mad she ain't over it libra he ain't over it libra okay this motherfucker has that they're scorned for mother for little timmy fucking turner in their head okay because they ain't got the balls to bust a grape in Welch's fucking backyard here nor there i feel like for some of you all you already know who the fuck i'm talking about okay because spirit is saying you already know i got ready to light my paula santo and i heard the poppity pop 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 so Libra, I have to like really protect the fucking protect the energy, the message within this reading, okay? Because I did pick up on a lot of interference or an attempt to interfere or infiltrate, okay? Distract or completely motherfucking assassinate your character, your brand, all right? So some of you all, there's a need for you not to be worried. Four 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 could be of significant twelve, significance twelve twelve two twenty two. I'm also seeing twelve thirty three, seven eleven. 808 1010 This is a weird one, but I'm also seeing 13, 13 significant. Some of y'all are needing to look into your dark moon Lilith placement, wherever your dark moon Lilith lies, okay? As to, as, it, as it pertains to, like, um, persevering through some type of, like, obstacle or, like, persevering through adversity, okay? I'm also hearing stepping into your true node, astrology, astronomy, the study of the stars, the study of geometrical shapes and symbols within the astral space or literal dream interpretation could be of significance, okay? A lot of focus around, like, expanding within consciousness consciousness and your actual psychic awareness okay i'm also hearing telekinesis pyrokinesis okay um telepathy could be of significance as well i'm also hearing something regarding the acknowledgement or the recognition of something within your fucking ancestral line and and why you had to like transcend through those obstacles okay or i'm also hearing transcending through obstacles or uh, through obstacles is going to be significant some of you all may be going through some type of uh, career transition um as it pertains to like Okay, so for example, some of y'all may have been in like the law field or some of you all may, may have been in the field of law. Some of you all may have been in the field of teaching, but maybe you wanted to go into the field of real estate. Maybe you wanted to go in because it's something regarding properties, assets, okay, or some type of like real estate exam. No worries. If you're taking a real estate exam, I am hearing some of you all going to have to take it two times. If this is your second time taking it, baby, you will be successful, okay? I heard by, a hair on your, by the hair on your head. <laughs> but your ass gonna make it. That's all that fucking matters. Period. All right. Some of you all have some type of karmic tie to the lands in which you in which you live. Okay. Some of y'all are being called if you live like uh, Midwest or like um, I'm hearing East Coast Midwest. Okay. This could even be um, the in the North region. I am picking up on this could be like a short trip or some type of like epiphany that you're gonna have while taking some type of trip or you're traveling somewhere. Okay, this could be like a short travel, but you're meant you're, you're being guided somewhere to have some type of epiphany, and that epiphany has to do with the seeds in which you've planted or you're meant to plant. Spirit is sending you. I'm also hearing some of you all. You're gonna realize that you're meeting ascended masters like. I know it's kind of weird to ask people their motherfucking life path number or some shit. You know what I'm saying? But I am picking up on something having to do with um, life path, ascended masters. Some of you all are ascended ma masters. Spirit is literally aligning you with your purpose at this time. And whatever the hell is, dis is being dismantled or feels as if it's being eclipsed out, Libra, there's a need for you to be accepting, allowing, and surrendering, and, not, and understanding. Because for some of you all, this is about an understanding. I pick up on 80% of my Libras on their shit. 
But there's a twenty. There's another twenty percent of y'all that's straddling the fence as it pertains to validation from other motherfuckers, whether it's family and their fucking um, ideology. Okay. I'm also hearing something regarding Aztec or Mayan ideology. Okay. I'm also hearing something regarding genealogy. Some of you all could be studying the various races of star seeds and like blood types as well. Okay. A lot of a lot of focus around your overall optimal health. Okay, lifestyle changes could be of significance for some of you all. Something um, I'm I'm hearing something's no longer agreeing with your digestive system. Okay. Okay, so let's get into it. I'm hearing something regarding dairy. Okay, fluoride. Some of you guys could be teaching this. Let's get into it. We're gonna see uh, what messages you guys get or what crystal you guys get using the uh, crystal wisdom healing oracle deck. I love these damn cards, y'all. Because you can actually use the damn cards as crystals if you don't have that damn crystal. Save me some shmoney. Libra, y'all like to save y'all motherfucking money. I got Libra rising. I said, gang. Uh, you hear me? All right. Scrambled. Scrambled inconsistency. Something's inconsistent, Libra. You're able to see something clearly. Your vision, okay? The expansion of your vision. Foresight. Premonitions, visions, the sight. I'm also hearing clear essence, clear sentience. All right. Some of you all is going through some type of like sacral chakra release or sacral chakra activation as well. That's significant. You guys got. It looks like cherioite. Oh, if I didn't say that right, it's gonna be the word today. Cherioite number fifty five 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 changes. Okay. Again, I keep hearing dismantling. Something being dismantled, completely tore down. Your ancestors is tired of something or someone's shit, all right? Some of you, okay. So, chariot, or chero, however the fuck you say this now. I skipped English. Let's go. Wound healing. Chariot provokes deep physical and emotional healing. Transmuting negative energy, it converts dis-ease to wellness. With its assistance, you recognize that your greatest trauma is also your most profound gift. Accept it with grace. Cherio re-energizes, heals, and integrates dualities, healing past life dis-ease carried into this present life. Deep fears and schisms pervade your being. Yeah, pervade your being. You may not feel that you belong on earth. Alienation and insecurity lie beneath the deceptively calm surface. You are subtly, you are subtly dr driven by other people's thoughts and programs rather than your own. Your atomic nervous system may be malfunctioning, so if it need so it needs recalibrating. I'm gonna get some fucking glasses this year. I keep saying that. <laughs> Time to take control. You are undergoing a vibrational change, creating links to higher realities. Visions of past lives suggest ways to redress karma personally and collectively. In accepting the present moment as perfect, you create the space to heal. The frequency of this stone is high, good for all chakras, good for any sign or any energy, okay, and those with the soul path of service to humanity, healing the wounds of the past. So I'm literally hearing master teachers, master numbers, master teachers, um, spiritual teachers, gurus, energy healers, okay, holistic practitioners. Some of you all are stepping into the practice or stepping into the pathway or your purpose of the, of, of teaching, enlightening, okay, receiving divinity. I heard stop denying your magic. Stop denying your magic, Libra, okay? Don't sleep on you. So let's get it. Let's get an angel message for you guys. We're going to get an angel message for you guys. I can't make this video too long because I have a reading in just a moment. Whoa. Okay, so let's see what spirit has for Libra. Angel skies, please give me an angel card for Libra. Angel message for Libra. Comfort. I'm with you in your time of need. Okay, Neptune. So dismantling or seeing through illusions crystal clear, okay? This could also be dealing with like um institutions as well. Institutions, some of y'all could be literally dealing with the Pisces or some type of like interference having to do with the Pisces. Okay, this could also be some type of like spiritual warfare, psychological warfare, or literally someone raging war on you. Okay, through the mind. Okay, so this could even be someone trying to um, attack your psyche, psychic, psyche, psychic attacks. All right, black tourmaline could be of significance for you guys. Some of y'all could be using black tourmaline. I'm also hearing something having to do with carnelian, create, protecting your creative genius is what I'm hearing. Comfort, Archangel Azrael, 
I'm with you in your time of need, helping your heart to heal, okay? The color blue could be of significance, all right? A lot of angelic protection, all right? Some of you all, someone could be attacking you, but spirit is wanting you to keep working. Keep working. You're very, very, very much so in your Venusian energy. So for some of you all, you're attracting or you, you're, you're, you're realizing um, how beneficial it is on your soul's journey to attract, not chase, or not try to force the issue. If something doesn't want to be fixed, healed, or fucking love, then why do you keep fucking overexerting yourself in order to do it? It's only draining and hurting you, okay? Some of you all, this is actually causing some type of blockage within your money or some relationship is karmic to your money. I immediately heard Taurus, Gemini, Virgo. Cancer, Pisces. Some of y'all need to forgive a Scorpio. Or there's stress issues surrounding a Scorpio. What the hell is this? Okay. Could also be an Aries. Okay. Or something significant to an Aries. Some of you all may have a, a spirit guide that is an Aries. Or some of you all are being called to be a spirit guide to an, a spirit guide to an Aries. Or you have a divine connection to an Aries. Chakra clearing. Archangel Metatron, call upon me to clear and open your chakras using sacred geometrical shapes. Some of you all may be um, actually connect Okay, so I'm hearing the raising of the Kundalini, okay? A lot of tapping into that creative energy using using the, uh, through transmutation, okay, of pain or transmutation of trauma. Turning your pain into power, bitch. You throw some lemons at me, bitch. We making a fucking lemonade factory, bitch. I got lemon drip everywhere. You hear what I'm saying? Listen. Also, a lot of focus on the grounding of the crown chakra or a lot, something here regarding uploads, downloads, okay? You receiving a lot of uh, intuitive messages, but I am hearing shapes, symbolisms, shapes, symbolisms. I'm also hearing spiritual practices, beliefs, all right? Ideology, outdated thinking, conditioning, or some type of like mental conditioning or reprogramming of the subconscious. Something falling away, dismantling, or something being completely... Um, the word I'm looking for had a brain fart. We're going to keep it fucking moving. But something being, again, completely dismantled. All right? But I'm also hearing with this chakra clearing. Some of y'all could also, also, there's a need for you to meditate. Or some of you all are, um, again, energy healers. Or you could be looking through, looking for some type of, like, spiritual practitioner to go to. Or some of y'all want to know if you can trust the fucking spiritual practitioner. All right? Yeah. Earth. So some of you all are needing to get grounded or connect with the element of earth. Get outside, Libra. Outside is good for you, all right? For some of you all, I am hearing. Okay, so my condolences to you if you just recently lost someone who could have been some type of maternal figure. Or um, this could be, I'm hearing maternal figure. So this could be grandmother, aunt, sister, okay? Um, my condolences go to you, baby. I'm sending you a whole bunch of damn healing, restoration, and a lot of love, all right? Prayers up to you, babes, all right? But brilliant idea. Archangel Uriel. Yes, your idea is divinely guided. Please take action and bring your idea into fruition. For some of you all, again, uploads, downloads. Some of y'all are actually communicating with your ancestors within the astral realm. Someone's giving you some type of like clear. Okay, sometimes somebody's giving you some type of clear direction. Someone could also be advising you about a specific person. This could be someone who you work with, do business with. Some of y'all, this is someone who you just recently ended a relationship with. Some of y'all is also having some type of epiphany um, with starting. I'm hearing podcasts, okay? So y'all, these y'all messages coming in very fast. Excuse me if I'm talking too fast, but I'm hearing podcasts. Some of you all, this could also be some type of platform that you're starting that you've been delaying. But Spirit is saying, um, I'm trying to work through you. Spirit is wanting to work through you, okay? Your ancestors, the Most High God, um, Orishas, whoever it is that you work with, they're wanting to work through you, okay? I heard divine interference, divine intercession. Earth. Some of y'all are getting a lot of downloads outside. I'm also hearing animal totems. Lizards could be of significance. Libra. I'm also seeing something regarding the praying mantis. Okay. So let's see. I'm going to pull a few of these. Because I didn't want to make this video too long at all, Libras. Alright. Let me make sure you have for my Libras. Okay, so you guys got judging your beliefs. So for some of you all, again, this could actually be the falling away of any type of like ties to religious beliefs. Some of you all are really walking within the spiritual. And some of you all are, are, are discovering how religion has kept you, uh, kept you binded in a sense as it pertains to like your ability to expand and grow and also be completely in tune with self. So for some of you all, someone's projecting their beliefs. Again, I'm hearing environmental changes. Some of y'all are needing to declutter. Some of y'all could be giving some things away at this time as well. 
there is some type of energetic tie to some item that you have in your home. Tie is tied to a Leo. Spirit is saying you got to get rid of it. Okay. Ancestral bitch. When I'm good, I'm good. Ancestral interference. Okay. So for some of you all, this could be involving a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Some of y'all could also be dealing with an er uh, another air sign. But with this judging your beliefs, they could be judging your damn beliefs. All right. You could be actively collaborating with this person. But I am hearing something regarding someone collaborating or reaching out or like having access to you to get the 411 on your life not because this person sent not because this person gives a damn someone wants to I'm hearing someone can no longer thrive off of your pain someone can no longer benefit from you now that you're growing I'm also hearing something regarding um with this collaboration some of you I'm also hearing your ancestors gave you an idea the reason why it's not growing through a partnership is because this collaboration some of y'all, you have a blessed collaboration with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But for some of you all, you've been collaborating with somebody who's been judging your goddamn beliefs. So whatever is dismantling around business, if there was a partner, okay, Spirit is saying it had to happen because you don't know this person's heart, all right? But you do have help on the way. For some of you all, you have a water sign that's assisting you with achieving some type of goal or giving you some type of like resourceful information as it pertains to like growing something, investing in something. I'm also hearing something regarding stock exchange trade, okay? Some of you all be very careful, especially if you have a child with this person. Check somebody's intentions before you allow them to like completely come all the way in. Because some of y'all have uh, a water sign individual that's trying to trap you or keep you stuck. Again, someone stuck in their own damn belief system. Yes, they're using you. So some of y'all, this could be involved in an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. All right. Spirit is saying that someone's using you for your information, using you for your knowledge. Or this is your ass, Libra, doing this to another person. Because for some of you all, I'm hearing your hands is not fucking fully clean for some of y'all. All right. Some of you all could be um, herbal practitioners. Okay. Or you could be learning more about herbs or ways to holistically heal yourself at this time as well. Okay. So, let me get some. I'm going to get two love cards for y'all. See what's going on with Libras in love. Karmic relationship, alright? Fleeting, triggers, turmoil, resentment, lessons, letting go and loving you. Self-love, alright? Really connecting with that love of self and understanding and acknowledging certain patterns, ideologies, okay? Certain, um, certain things that have been like continuous or secular within your ancestral line all right and you put them to fucking rest coffin endings bring new beginnings growth change liberation transition whatever the fuck is being dismantled libra allow it to go this is a sacrificial gain in order for you to fucking reach new heights greater heights in order for you to grow and actually see the things flourish before your eyes that in which you've been manifesting for the course i'm hearing for the last for some of y'all three months for some of y'all three years for some of you all this could be three weeks okay heartbroken deeply hurt sad separation breakup feeling lost grieving mourning okay some of you all there's a need for you to use that energy transmute that energy i'm hearing this is some something was triggering you to help you. someone someone was sent in your life to trigger you okay by ways of a karmic relationship in order for you to like really connect with what it is so, so what it is it's like what was meant to break you actually in, actually ended up making you great libra or it will. Okay. So let me get y'all some advice. Hold on. Who the fuck is Libra dealing with? Who y'all dealing with? This could be your sign of the sign in which you're dealing with. It's astrologic placements. Okay. Oh. So you guys got Cancer Moon. Scorpio Moon. Cancer Rising. Taurus Moon. Scorpio. Capricorn Rising. And Taurus. Okay. So let me give Libra a card of advice. I'm going to go and get the hell out of here. Okay, that one to jump out. Baby, Spirit say, worry not. You are protected, baby. Acknowledge. You have to heal and see what needs to be healed in order for things to be properly built, my baby. Hold tight. Your time is near and here. Protect your ideas. Protect your craft. Believe in your motherfucking self like you believe in waking up each day, baby. And just know that perseverance, victory, abundance, success is yours. All right, so you guys, I love you. Oh, bitch! At the bottom of the deck, you are supported. I did not tell you, baby. You got help from here and there. Don't be prideful, Libra. Be, but don't be afraid to ask for help. It's a time to receive. Again, that Venusian energy attracting. Okay, beneficial contacts, beneficial collaborations, people that can help you grow. So motherfuckers who fucking using you ain't giving back to you. You can't fucking ask them for a motherfucking thing. Allow that to be dismantled, baby. They got to go. Right. 
So you guys, I send you so much love. Thank you so much. And I pray that this message finds you in love, light, and a whole bunch of divine wisdom, you guys. Sending you guys love and a whole lot of light and a whole lot of big money back energy, my babies. I love y'all.